it's Jocelyn. So today I'm going to be doing this back to school dewy makeup look because back to school is coming up soon or at least it kind of is for me. Like where'd summer go, you know? Before I forget, this is a collab with one of my good friends, Sophia, and I'll link her video that she did on her channel and her channel down below. Make sure you guys subscribe and give that video a thumbs up. And also, if you're new, hi. I'm Jocelyn. I make videos every single Saturday and it would mean so much if you would subscribe right down there. I believe you know where the button is. I mean, I don't really have to tell you. I mean, my goal by my birthday, which is August 28th, is to get to 200 subscribers. I believe we can do it. We are very close, very close. And also for the month of August, since it is my birthday month, I'm going to be posting two videos a week starting August 5th. My bun, nobody told me my bun was falling out. Okay, so first thing I'm going to use is this Mario Badescu spray. And it's just the eight fluid ounce. Um, got the bigger size. This is actually going to be like a first impressions. Because a little is gone because I wanted to smell it, but I never actually like use it on my face. It smells like super rosy. I didn't really know. I have this like rash thing right here. Um, don't know what that's from. I'm gonna go ahead into foundation, and this is also gonna be like a first impressions because um I bought a lot of makeup. I always wanted to try this Maybelline, this Maybelline Dream Matte Mousse. It looks like this. I was confused of how it was like gonna be like mousse. Mousse goes in her hand. Shook. A little is gone because it got on the cap. How am I supposed to apply this? Where's the beauty blender? Did you hear that voice crack? Beauty blender. I'm not a beauty expert. I hope you guys like the new background. I tried. And also, camera quality is a little different because I'm not filming on my normal camera. <laughs> I'm just going to use this Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer. This is like one of my all-time favorite concealers. And also, I'm going to put it on my eyelids just because I have really veiny eyelids. And they're like purplish, which just sounds weird, but it's, it's normal, right? I just kind of put concealer wherever my dark spots were, so that's a lot of places. So I'm one and out beauty blender. I like the way this concealer is blending with the foundation. I think it like makes everything like so flawlessly. I'm gonna set just my under eye because hang on, I'll just wait a second. I'm gonna set my under eye with the L'Oreal True Match foundation. I've been using this since like seventh grade. Not the same exact one, but like, I'm just gonna like do this. And my face is pretty much set from the foundation. I need to find, um, I forgot what I was gonna say. Do I look like a man? It's like a thing. It's meant for pencils. I'm gonna zoom in for eyeballs. <laughs> Ignore my eyebrows right now. They're just gonna like chill. So for my eyes, I'm just gonna take this L'Oreal Paris LA palette and nude. I've literally used this since day one of YouTube. I'm first going to go in with this classic gold color and then I'm going to take my blending brush with this color next to it. It's like this light brown. I'm going to go into my crease. So what I like to do, like when I'm going into my crease with a darker shade, I like to just take a little and then tap it off and then put it in my crease and build it up because if you go too much at one time, it'll look kind of splotchy. Now I'm moving on to my eyebrows. Let me zoom you back in. So for my eyebrows, I don't know how to do eyebrows, so I'm just going to brush them out. Very simple. Um, I should have plucked my eyebrows before this video. It's okay, it's okay. So there you go. Eyebrows don't look too bad. Too bad today. I, I kind of like this one more than this one, but like, that's okay, right? So then, moving on to e.l.f. blush. I like this blush. One, because it's like pink, and my cheeks from summer going into school year are already like somewhat pink. Do you already see that glow? But it's on my cheek. So next, I'm going to take my all-time favorite highlighter. Um, this is the e.l.f. Baked Highlighter in 
Moonlight Pearl. Like, if that's not blinding, then I don't know what is, you know? So I'm going to take it with my finger and put it on my nose. I'm going to blend in a second, don't worry. Blinding. Oh, God. Blinding. I tell you, it's blinding. I also realized that I haven't really been looking into the camera because, well, this camera has a viewfinder now, so... There you go. I think that's pretty subtle for school. You don't want to be so blinding. I'm not going to bronze just because. Or contour. One, because the only bronzer that I ever used is now too light for me because I got tan. So, uh, moving on back to eyes for like eyeliners and mascara. So, yeah. So, I'm just going to use this Color Workshop eye pencil. It's very small. But it's in brown just because it can like match my natural eyelash color. Kind of go on my waterline. So that's one eye completed. So that's the completed eyeliner portion of it. I wanted to go super simple for back to school. So yeah, moving on to mascara. Oh wait, 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 wait. wait. So I'm going to curl my eyelashes with these eyelash curlers. I keep looking at myself. I'm just like. And when I curl them, I like to like bring them up. I'm not sure if that's how you're supposed to do it, and I'm just like curling my eyelashes normally for once. But it, it makes a difference, you know? When I'm done curling my eyelashes, I'm gonna use this last and la la la. I'm gonna use this Maybelline Lash Sensational Somo Plutex. This wand though, it's like it's like plastic, like hard plastic. Are you joking? Okie dokie, are you joking? How do I even fix this? Okay, this is my favorite spot to put highlighter because why not save like the best for last? I'm gonna take my highlighter and my pinky and just go in like right on the top of your brow bone. There you go. And then lastly, of course, we're gonna do our lips and this is just the number seven lip gloss um, in shade. It doesn't say it, but a type or allergenic, so a little goes a long way in this stuff. And then we got it! And then to top it all off, I'm gonna take my Mario Badescu so spray again and just spray all over my face. It sets all the powder. Although I didn't really use powder, but like. So yeah. So that is it for this like back to school, dewy, fresh makeup tutorial not really a tutorial but a look <laughs> if you are new make sure you subscribe and also subscribe to Sophia please 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 check out her channel and her video she puts lots of time and effort into making her videos and you can really see that 